Okay, so we've got our Anthropocene here for our um, Unit 9 ex our, of Acceleration. Um, so in the Anthropocene, we've got the um, now. It's, it's now. We, we have this world, and we're living it to whatever we can. Um, and it's the it's current geological age we're living in. Um, human activity is increasing and increasing and increasing. And um, more population, more collective learning, better innovation for technology. Um, and kind of like the thing that's helped change it, like move it along, and like stuff that's happened off of that is like the Industrial Revolution in um, Europe when they had all their smoke and ash and stuff coming off the machines, and they changed like moths from white to black. And it's um, more along the lines of evolution and stuff, and how we're evolving and making our life better and our future generations better. So we all started from um, expansion and interconnection, where the world like, didn't have that many people, but we started learning and getting bigger and having more civilizations and stuff. And uh, so in the, uh, that, that shifted into uh, the Enlightenment and the Industrial Revolution. And with the Enlightenment came new ideas and new ideals where um, more people wanted different government and it's kind of a fall of monarchy where monarchy won't last anymore because these people are coming up with ideals and stuff that they want to happen. industrialized um, and being able to communicate more um, and that moves in to the political ideas and economic ideas of the, the world um, and, um, the Enlightenment directly connects to Atlantic revolutions and democracy how the Atlantic revolutions were becoming more like people were having their different ideals and so they wanted a uh, different government and so they started revolving and their government, their, their country. Um, and then with imperialism and the Industrial Revolution and nationalism and fascism, they've got their um, different ideas and their different companies that are becoming more advanced and different things um, that help the country progress or degress. Um, and then nationalism kind of connects with that, how it's like people are feeling better than other people, and so they become more powerful, and they get more money and more money, so they can contribute that to more machines and more innovation. And then with global conflicts and global changes, um, we've got like the World War II, where everybody was fighting, and um, with, without that, um, without the Industrial Revolution, it wouldn't have really been much. Um, and that directly connects with the ideas because people are coming up with their things they want to do, and um, so it changes. And so people are like, I'm gonna fight for this because this is what I think. And then in like the end of the Malthusian cycles, it's like we're, we're innovating so much that we can't really lose our population because of genetic, genetically modified food and stuff. So um, we've got the end of Malthusian cycles, and then the population explosion is like huge. It's going from a few like a hundred thousand to a couple million, and so we've got that. And then um, we've got like environmental threats, where it's like the the, the biosphere is changing, and it might not be too good. Um, you know, the atmosphere is getting more polluted. Like in Japan, they have a ton of different like machines there. So the machines are producing different um, like chemicals in the air, and so it's destroying the environment. Um, and then technological technological innovation, it's like um, like advancements in like 
communication, um, transportation, and medicine and stuff. Because without the medicine we got from like um, different people coming up with these new ideas for medicine, then we would have very poor health care, which kind of is in with global um, changes, how we're changing our medicine and our, like, our um, health care. And then this all directly connects to the Anthropocene. It's all building up to this one thing, which is us, and making us better. So this is our poster, and...